Hey, me again, guys. Basically, you're here for the DFC Kaak Diversity for Crisis Akaton, the first ever Akaton focus on diversity because di diversity is not charity. Like many people think that diversity is charity, it's not. Diversity is the DNA of innovation, and we have incredible people right now on this night for the European and African challenge. So, welcome on stage, my people. Julian, Antonin, and Dominique. Hello. So, Hello, so, everyone. Cool. So can you introduce yourself, uh, Dominic, and after we'll be Julian and at the end, uh, Antonin? Hey, everybody. I'm Dominic. I'm the founder and CEO of Hackathon Entertainment. We publish stories all across the world about hackathons, makeathons, and innovation-related events. We see, we help organizers host events like this and share a lot, a lot of knowledge that we have gained from hackathons all over. And I am a maker. I publish lots of videos about developing apps with code, with no code, turning your ideas into real projects. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, and uh, uh, yeah, Antonia? Yeah. Hi, guys. I'm Antonin. I'm the founder of Solpedin, and I'm working in an incubator called the Why Not Factory, helping students to create their own companies. And I'm really glad to, to be there tonight. Cool. Julian, our superstar, more than three live on, in one week. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. So my name is Julian. Three live in one week. It's true. Uh, I am in charge of the incubation program of Cage Business School, a uh, French top 10 business school uh, in France, Marseille, Bordeaux, and Paris. And uh, tonight, uh, we will award the first prize of uh, the uh, European Challenge because the winner will win six months incubation uh, in Cage in full digital. Cool, cool, cool. So, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm very happy. I'm very happy to have you there. And, uh, yeah, we, we, we start with the feedback because uh, we are talking a lot. You know, it, it was very hard to make a choice, right? Yeah. <laughs> very hard to make a choice, but finally you, you made it, and uh, yeah, it's cool. So, Dominic, can you uh, uh, give the feedback for the for the teams, you know, give your thoughts, you know, because you have a lot of insights. So we, yeah. we are ready to listen to you. So we had to select, we had to really categorize or score on five main categories, business, coolness, re realistic, impact and confidence and it was very tough for us everyone really put a lot of effort into the projects and that that really showed a project that we i i guess the right word that we we all agreed on that we liked a lot was pit my car and we found that pit my car was realistic we, we loved the concept. We loved that it had a lot of business viability. We loved that, and I'm just looking at my notes, it had a lot of cool factor and impact. We also wanted to highlight no trace, no spoil. We, we thought it was very, very novel. We thought that it could have a lot, a lot of social impact. And, and we loved that it, it was realistic and we could see the vision for the project yeah cool so also i think you have uh, some uh, project like uh, G uh the project from uh, egypt can you rebut for example rebut and tarifa so you have some also inside because some for example tarifa don't use the proper english and a uh, rebut something can what do you say can you say um, uh, Terrify was a little bit harder for me to interpret because I was going back and forth with uh, Google Translate because I'm only English. I'm probably the yeah. only person that's only English speaking, unfortunately. I really liked uh, Rebat and I actually scored Rebat fairly high. Probably what went against Rebat and for the team that's watching, there are similar business models here in the UK similar businesses here in the UK and in the US that are doing really, really well. So keep pushing with your project, especially if it's focused on the region where you don't have anything like that. It just wasn't novel compared to, we, we see a lot of hackathons, we see a lot of projects, and in different regions of the world, there's certain projects that come up over and over again. I don't want that to, 
deter you from your idea because I think it's a really good idea. And in terms of social impact, it's a really important idea. It's just in the scope of this competition, there were other projects that stood out a little bit more. Cool, 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 cool. So many people say, oh, why why would we take the suspense? Yeah, yeah, we don't want to announce the winner like that. So take <laughs> take your time, take your time. So and share, right now, if you saw the video, the live right now, share it, share it everywhere because Cage mm -hmm. is there, like Cage is there. And uh, we have a lot of, a lot of sponsor, a lot of jewelry, amazing jewelry, uh, amazing jewelry, <laughs> uh, share it, very important. So yeah. Antone, so, First of all, before give the name of the the second. So, can you introduce yourself? Can you can you was talking about your incubator because you do amazing things in uh, in France, Paris? Say yeah, we want to know more about it. Yeah, no problem. Uh, the incubator is the Why Not Factory, and we we created that like four four years ago because uh, we realized a lot of students wanted to create their company but uh, there they were no no help available so so it was my case i created my company using this incubator and uh, everything went so cool that uh, that now uh, i'm working for the incubator too and uh, and i'm glad to to help every student uh, in france especially in paris but but not only uh, to to do, to go and to to create their company because I think it's the it's the best time of our life to to create a company is when when we are students because there's no no real risk uh, if you if you fail if you, you can start over or or just find a job and uh, and at this age that there, there's there's no way you can fail it just just pleasure everybody around you is uh, is helping you so so just start your business and and, and it will be fine and uh, I'm, I'm really glad to be to be there tonight uh, I, I, like, like Dominic said uh, full of really good project and it was really cool to to, to watch them and, and to and to see see all of that Cool, cool. Thanks so much for your commitment. Thanks so much for all thing you do for, for, for the GFCI, for ConnectX. So you do a great job for, for, for this amazing Silicon Sanchez. Again, Coco Rico, for the Silicon Sanchez. Uh, so, Dominic, what, what is the name of your Silicon Valley in, in UK? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I don't know. In <laughs> London. So I'm based in London. And yeah. London, like many cities in the world, like Paris, like Silicon Valley, yeah. Because so many people here, it's huge for the for the tech scene. We have a lot of fintech startups, so financial technology startups, because we have a lot of those type of incubators connected to Barclays, HSBC, all these different types of banks. But you see a lot of talent coming out of London. What I think you're going to see more and more of is talent dispersed outside of cities. So with with COVID happening all over the world things are starting to change. And I think people, investors and incubators and accelerators are starting to think more about what talent is there in rural communities or suburban communities. There's, there's cities throughout the UK that are not London that have lots of talent, great universities that are getting more attention, more and more attention now. But I'm not cool. sure... I'm not sure. Our equivalent is just London, I guess. Yeah, you know I mean? uh, we will use the L London Tech, for example. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> because sometimes I saw L London Tech, or sometimes they say uh, um, uh, start, uh, UK, Startup Nation, something like that, because mm -hmm. Ireland also have the Startup Nation, I uh, Ireland Startup Nation. So, yeah, we use the term of London Tech. So, Julian, how I assume yes. Can you <laughs> share? more about the cage entrepreneur and key video, right? What do you do uh, all yeah. the time for, for entrepreneurs? Yeah, for sure. So in, in cage, we created uh, as Antonin, uh, an incubator because we have seen, we have a lot of students willing to create their own company. So uh, at the at present, we have 12,000 students uh, in all the companies of cage. Uh, and we are by year 500 people who apply to uh, follow the incubation program uh, in Cage. So a lot of uh, students who want to launch their, their company. Uh, we have uh, each year we help 100 people to launch and to create their, their company in all our campuses, Bordeaux, Marseille, 
Toulon in the south of France and Paris, of course. Uh, and we have uh, also um, an accelerator program for people who are more uh, with uh, the first, uh, uh, first, um, ah, uh, first financing, etc., etc. I lose, I lose my words tonight. Sorry, <laughs> but we are very exciting to be here to help you. And uh, Kedge is very happy uh, to uh, award the first prize and to help you during six months uh, in your journey of entrepreneur. Cool, cool. So, Anthony, you know, we need now to know who is who is the second uh, winner of the, 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 not the first, just the second, winner of the challenge. That means they, they, they are, they, they win some, some assets, some access to the catch, uh, ecosystems. systems. They are not. They are not in the incubator, but they are a part. That means they are a part of the uh, innovator ecosystem, and also could be part of the factory uh, incubator too. We don't know. We don't know. So, can you give the name, please? Yes, the second winner is no trace, no spoil. Uh, yes. Uh, guys, I really like your project. It was re really cool. Uh, I really like the concept. I think the, the impact could be really huge. Um, uh, the, the only question still open for me is how about the, the first step of the project, uh, because it's the, so it's the project that, that will allow uh, uh, food. Uh, it's it's a biosensors that allows people to see if food is good or not. But uh, I think it's it's like a um, a big uh, big innovation, and that's why my my question is: Well, what is the first step that you can make to test this, this project and to to put it in the market? Uh, congratulations for this second place. Uh, personally, I'm very interested to keep in touch with you. Uh, so I will uh, I will ask Basley to give me your contact, of course, because I'm sure this team can really go far with this project. Congratulations, guys! Cool, cool. Thanks so much, uh, Antonio, for 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 your attention and for sure, definitely, I will introduce you to this amazing team. And uh, yeah, we can do great thing together for the next step of this amazing uh, project and idea. So this is a momentum, like. The kumbaya moment, as people say, like the kumbaya moment. So, but you know, we, we like, you know, take uh, again a little assistance, you know. Um, yeah, so, Gideon, so what do you provide in this amazing incubation? What is uh, the content, you know? Because people are like, hey, what the name? No, 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 but not the name. Just a little, a little assistance. What, what do you, you provide to the winner uh, during this amazing uh, program? So yeah, our, in our program, uh, you will have a, a lot of things to help you in your in your journey. At first, you will have a digital platform with all the content video to uh, win some competencies to know how to lead on uh, Google Ads, Facebook Facebook Ads, how to sales. So you have a complete digital platform to help you in your journey. Then you will have, of course, workshop every month uh, dedicated on your needs that will help you with. Uh, the major specialists uh, on the market that will help you uh, in your growth. And then the more important uh, in the incubation program, we have specialists in all uh, you need, uh, marketing, sales, uh, growth hacking, uh, legal, and you have one-to-one -one with them. You can uh, book a meeting with them. It's uh, very easy to do. And uh, the, you will have a dedicated uh, help on your needs. So it's a very qualitative uh, incubation and uh, it will help you uh, of course uh, to uh, to start on uh, i hope to uh, become maybe olicom in the coming months and uh, maybe in the coming uh, years but uh, it's uh, the what we can guess for you okay last question actually the network of all, all alumni arcade is like a month of how many people so uh, I think Cage is the first uh, network of alumni uh, for the French Business School because we have uh, 70,000 uh, alumni in all over the world. Wow. Uh, and it's a big, big network. We have uh, five people who uh, work full-time in Cage uh, to uh, uh, to uh, create, uh, to uh, 
help this network to grow and to be organized. Uh, and it's, uh, of course, very useful for startups because uh, we can find some mentors, find some people who uh, work in uh, the same uh, uh, category of, uh, of uh, work. And it's uh, sometimes very useful for our startups too. Cool. So, and uh, the winner is? And the winner is, so maybe I will have some uh, words before uh, yeah, his name. Ahead. So it was uh, a very interesting uh, project. Uh, we had a lot of work on this because it's a B2C approach uh, with a lot of acquisition uh, to work on. Uh, but uh, I really liked uh, the social impact vision. I really liked uh, the, the way of doing it because it's quite different of other projects uh, that I have seen on uh, this topic. Uh, and the winner is Pick My Car. So, okay. <laughs> so Pick My Car, we were very... Uh, it was very surprising to see uh, the determination, all the work you have done, because uh, there is a very qualitative um, presentation with a logo, with a, a chart. Uh, we see uh, you have the sense of the details, and it's very important uh, about it. Um, I think um, I could ask also the same question as Anthony asked, uh, how can you uh, be in the concrete tomorrow? But I have an, an idea of how you can be concrete tomorrow because you can test it very uh, fast. Uh, so you can be uh, very fast in the concrete. Uh, that's what I liked in your project because uh, we could help uh, you on it. Uh, and uh, I think it will be a, a great opportunity uh, for Cage and for you uh, to match and uh, to help you uh, in this journey. So congratulations. And I hope I will have uh, your email in uh, the coming uh, minutes. <laughs> For sure, for sure, because, you know, uh, as I say all the time, ConnectX is not just uh, a, a platform. Many people say, oh, are you incubator? Are you accelerator? I say, no, no, we are not incubator. We are not accelerator. We are not investor. We are connector. Like, we create a new model is connector. That means you must be connected with for somebody else, very uh, fair, very uh, right in your niche, etc. Like right connection is not linking. Because sometimes they say, oh, linking do no linking. You have a lot of email spamming. You you spend a lot of time for nothing. You do a lot of call and you can make nothing. But this kind of connection is the right connection. That means you win when you win. Uh, you have the right connection with the you know your 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 head for the incubation is real. It's not fake. Right, so for sure, I will definitely you introduce you, connect you as connect text mm. with you, Julian. So is 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 just amazing to show how uh, how Davis is huge. Like this man, this man, he he, he, he is not tech. He made a, a, a CTO from Bangladesh. Then put then made a prototype in more in less than one week. This is a proof that diversity is not a charity. No. Diversity is innovation. So you mix many people from all over the world. So and you create something like that. And uh, in this team, you have also many people, uh, friends, but some, some uh, with some uh, African origin, uh, some uh, some uh, Latin origin. So the the, the Pink Mica team is very very mixed, and uh, we like this fact that uh, diversity win. And I thank so much for that. So. Before I stop this uh, this live, but you know when I stop the live, we have our little after live. So, what is your final uh, word? I will start with uh, Dominique. So, Dominique, what is your final uh, word? Uh, my final word, uh, well, for all the teams, is to enjoy the process, regardless if you're first, second, or whatever. Really, it doesn't matter. In a hackathon, it's about connecting with people, like you know, connect it. But really, I'm I'm so serious about hackathons are about connecting with people. They're about learning, making new relationships. Because someone you met through this hackathon in 20 years time might be giving you a job. In 20 years time, that may, might be a co-founder of your company. In 20 years, this everything that happened at this hackathon is the start or the beginning of a long journey that cool. Thanks is so much worth for that. looking so, for. So, Antonia? Yes, um, final words. Guys, you are the future, so just keep going. Uh, it's not about winning or losing. 
It's just about enjoying what you're doing in life and 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 doing things that that you like and and keep keep going in in this direction because the projects, all of them, all that we we have seen uh, in this week are pretty good and most more than the project, the the people are amazing. So so keep keep going. You are the future. Thanks, thanks, Julian, our superstar. <laughs> Oh, sorry, I'm mute. Ah, yeah. Yeah, maybe two advices. Uh, at first, continue, keep going, of course. Uh, you have an idea. Uh, it will be a pity to uh, let it uh, down, so continue. And my second advice would be be concrete. Test tomorrow. Uh, you don't have to have uh, an application, a website, a uh, web app, etc. You can test without it on, in no code with maybe three, four people, five people in the street. So go ahead, test. Uh, see if uh, it works or not, uh, find the market validation uh, and go for it. So that's my, my word. Thank you. Cool. Cool. So thanks so much for your attention. We will do after this live, our after uh, live and uh, quick. So thanks so much for your time. Thanks so much for your attention. And all people, every people show this live right now. It's, it's not a last live because you know that the final final the global final will be on 11 p.m cst and uh, before that normally in 10 a.m uh, or 9 uh, yeah in 10 a.m yeah in, no in 9 a 9 9 p.m cst we have our america's america's uh, uh semi-final so just amazing to so how we can make it like traveling so uh, in, the, in the afternoon we was in asia Right now we are in Africa and Europe. And after that we go to the Americas, North America, uh, South America. Just amazing how the world is so big yeah. and sometimes so little. So it's a global village. And uh, we, we like the fact that you guys, we, you are the part of this amazing historical moment because never ever a global hackathon focused on diversity was made. You are a okay. part of this historical moment, and thanks so much for that. Thanks so much for your attention. Mm -hmm. And all the people see you after because we have our America channel live. It was basically your for the DFC Act TV. So see you next time. Bye. Thank you, Leslie. Bye. Thank you.